Let's kick it off with Zillow. Today's gain, a huge jump to the upside. We're looking at gains of just about 7%, was trading up about 10% earlier in this session, the biggest daily jump that we have seen in the stock in about two months. The gains coming after Bank of America turning bullish on Zillow, upgrading the stock two notches to buy from underperform. Now, in a note, analyst Curtis Nagel writing that while early 2023 is going to be a challenge, he and his team are, quote, more confident that growth can return to double digits in 2024 on improved improving affordability. The new price target of 42 bucks higher from where we're trading today, substantially higher from the 22 bucks price target that it had on its previous rating. Zillow, the best performer among its peers today. And Dan, we were talking early in the show about the challenge that is facing the housing market right now. It might not improve over the next several months, but at least when we get to the second half of the year out into 2024, it looks like Bank of America joining the outlook there that things are only heading up from here. Yeah, I mean that's you know obviously the prediction here. I, look, my you know my wife and I are are looking to buy a house at some point this year. We don't know uh, exactly when just yet. Um, you know we have friends who got locked in with great interest rates. Obviously the interest rates right now nowhere near the the you know two percent that some people managed to lock in. So uh, makes it less appealing at this point. But you know I think like people uh, who were in my position who want to start looking or are, are already looking, there's never going to be a great time. So uh, yeah, I think it's the, the shock of the interest rate jumps and then obviously just kind of having to contend with that.